Thank you so much, Zoe. Yes, well, right now it's time to introduce you to a phenomenal young man. Now, a true achiever is someone who tackles every challenge as a learning experience, pushes themselves out of their comfort zone and rises above their circumstances. And this is no better way of describing our latest young achiever, a young man from Bishop Lavers in Cape Town who discovered that life can be truly magical. What I love about magic is that it takes you back to that childhood memories. I always wanted to do magic as a young kid, but I never pursued a career. I think magic, it just, it just takes you back to the young old days when you were a little child, saying the words abracadabra, hocus pocus, and you're seeing this amazing illusion is done. Jermaine Fortain is the 2016 Western Cape Junior Magic Champion, and he felt a calling towards magic when he saw a professional magician perform at his high school. I decided that I wanted to study it and I did two years on my own to study magic and then I started joining the College of Magic. So I'm at the college about three years now, I'm going to my fourth year and it took a lot of sacrifices for me. I, I had to do things like maybe put my schoolwork just for a minute aside to do my magic because I really wanted to learn maybe a difficult sleight of hand and I put in hours of practice. In fact, even years, I've been practicing one move for about two, three years now. My mom was the one to always inspire me, my mom was the one always to motivate me. And she then, lately I discovered that she got cancer. This again inspired me also to show her, to prove to her that I'm going to do something with my life. Last year, Jermaine's mom lost her battle with cancer. And the 19-year-old wanted to honour his mother by using his talent to build a bright future. Jamin is a hard worker and uh, he's uh, worked very, very hard at his magic and I think this is He's created a lot of his success. He's uh, got a lot of self-discipline. Jamian presented a remarkable performance for the Western Cape Championships, a very deserved winner, and we're very proud of him. It was, a, it was an amazing show, and uh, he's really going to great heights. After his provincial championship win, Jermaine had the opportunity to get some show experience and really push his already advanced skills. I was also working with the Cape Town Magic Club for, uh, for season three, and I did three nights with them. So every night, as time went on, my performances improved and I got the experience of a theatre environment. And I see myself in the next few years doing my own shows, running my own shows, having my own theatre where I can do shows and things. To become a, a very good magician takes many years and, uh, and although there's some easy magic, the magic that Jamin is doing is, is pretty uh, tough stuff. So uh, six years, I would say, and then you start getting to a level where Jamin is at and you can start performing and amazing people with that sort of, that standard of sleight of hand. Jermain specializes in close-up magic and illusion. His girlfriend and friends offer strong support and are his test audience. I've known Jamin for about four years now, I think, three to four years. And his way of presenting magic has been growing each year. He's doing good for himself. He's a very good person. He can communicate with other people well. I always enjoy watching his magic. He has a nice way of presenting the tricks. The next big goal for the aspiring magician is winning the national championships. And then hopefully theatre shows and TV appearances will come his way. I want to use my magic to in inspire other young kids to pursue a career or chase after their dreams. I mean, I came out of areas of Mitchell's Plain and Noah Park and then you're always seeing young kids going the wrong direction. My goal is just to inspire them, to uplift them, to do something better with their life.